Hello everyone, welcome to channel Gear Info Tech. The content for today is the Java 42 Bobber. Now let's talk about the front profile over here. If we talk about the front profile over here, it's a quite big handlebar. Nice and a grippy handlebar with the Java logo, Java badging, ORVMs, both sides. Headlamp with the DRLs like this. For you badging, chrome garnish on the headlamp, side turn indicators. The suspension is present on your screen. The vehicle is oil cooled, mud flap, tire size is on your screen. The vehicle comes in three different color options, copper, red and white. So now let's talk about the side profile of the bike over here. If we talk about the brakes, it offers you disc brakes in the front as well as in the rear with dual channel ABS. Yes, safety is the priority. Moving on to the fuel tank, fuel tank, as you can see, the Java badging on the fuel tank rubber protection on the fuel tank over here with Java badging. Nice thing. Moving on to the engine over here. The engine is a 350cc engine. Nice big cc engine which produces somewhat around 30 PS of power and 30 Nm of peak torque. Bobber badging over here, Bobber 42. the battery compartment, rear suspension, the single seat option, wide seat, black color mud flap, tail lamp, side turn indicators with a reflector, rear silencer and this is how the bike looks. So beautiful. So now let's talk about the handlebar over here. As you can see, the Java badging on the handlebar, clutch lever, pass options, more options, trip meter, indicators, horn, ORVM over here, charging ports, both A type and a C type. Very nice thing done by Java over here. Very cool. Instrument cluster. And this is how the bike looks when it hits the ignition. Hi, Java. Brake fluid. Engine kill option, hazard light. Start, fuel tank, 42 badging over here and a graphic design on the fuel tank which makes the bike so cool, big seat for a single passenger. The 6 speed transmission gearbox. So now I want to talk about the riding comfort of this bike, 42 bobber, yes. It offers you spokes wheels, yes, which is a very nice and intelligent thing done by bobber over here. Like you can take this vehicle for your off-roading stuff, you can also use it as an off-roading vehicle and also you can take it for cruising, both the things in a single bike. Coming on to the riding comfort of the bike, yes, riding comfort is good, but I think my legs Positioning is okay. It's okay. All right. All right. Now, moving on to the handlebars over here. Handlebars is also like they are positioned good, and my arms are not that much stretching over here. What I can say when I'll be riding this bike, I'll give you a better review. 
so yes from my opinion when i'll keep my legs over here i'll get a good comfort while riding definitely so now let's check out this beast this is how this beast roars so i hope you like this video make sure to like share and subscribe the channel thank you for watching the full video